question about how to make a colour change straight after a double increase on the front and back of a piece of double knitting. So here it is on the chart. The row I'm working on is this one with the pink underneath it. And I have to do a colour change right there, which is directly above the one stitch becomes three increase of the previous row. So I'll show you a couple of ways of doing this. You can sort the increase out first. There is another complete video on making these increases. And the front is a knit yarn over knit and the back is a purl yarn over purl. And before we make, or before we work across these stitches, you can sort them out into double knit sequence. So if you want to sort them out ahead of time, slip the first one onto the right hand needle, go round the back behind the two front stitches and go into the first of the increases. Then carefully slip those two front stitches off the needle and put them back again. Then we can take the second front stitch, go round the back, slip the front one off, pop it back on the needle, and then return those four stitches back to the left-hand needle. So they now go front, back, front, back, front, back, and we can work them in any pattern that takes your fancy. So in this case, I'm going to do knit in the original colour, so I'm matching the first pair. Reversing the colours of the second pair. And matching the third pair. That's probably the most straightforward way of doing it. The way I tend to make this colour change is a little bit more efficient. I actually work them as I go, so I take my first pair, so I'm sneaking round the back, do the stitch exchange, complete the first pair. Now I just have to remember to knit the second pair with the colours reversed. So I actually knit them at the same time as I sort them out. But this is a matter of practice. I've done thousands of these and it's a matter of what makes you most comfortable.